Welcome back to Engineering TV. I'm Turkey Knight with Tabor McCallum, who's the CEO of Paragon Space Development Systems. He's going to tell us how Paragon is involved with the Constellation Spacesuit System. Some of our viewers may not be familiar with the Constellation project. Could you go into that a little bit? NASA Constellation is the, the overarching set of technologies and vision for essentially the next generation in space. That includes the launch vehicles, uh, Ares 1 and 5, the Orion spacecraft, the Altair lunar lander, uh, the, the transfer stages, the spacesuit. So it's a, a suite of rather flexible components that is initially destined for the moon, but then without really a lot of change in most of the base components, we can transfer that to a mission to, the, to Mars or to an asteroid. So Constellation becomes a suite of exploration tools that uh, really sets up America to lead in space exploration. Is the design of this suit all Paragons? NASA recently uh, began work on the Constellation spacesuit system and awarded that to Oceaneering International, and we're on the Oceaneering team developing the spacesuit. Our responsibilities are lead in thermal control and doing life support uh, for the suit. This is the first time that NASA has developed a new suit in over 40 years. Uh, rather than having separate suits where uh, the uh, launch and landing occurs in one suit and EVA would occur in another suit and uh, a, a lunar sojourn would be in yet another suit, these suits are essentially one suit with modular chains out. So, Rather than carrying a bunch of different suits, we have one suit that's able with modifications to handle each of these environments and uh, protect the astronauts as needed. So this is clearly just a concept of what we're going. The NASA has a pretty well-developed initial design that we're beginning evaluation of and, and worked on in the proposal phase. So it's very exciting uh, that the people at NASA are very excited to, to keep this moving, and so are we.